Hi, uh, my name is Ed Petrosky. I'm a professional engineer with NTech Engineering out of Reading, Pennsylvania. I've uh, done a number of uh, projects where we've done aerobic digestion of the biosolids. And I'd just like to address some of those issues today and uh, help maybe answer some questions that you may have about the process. What features and benefits stand out when addressing the needs of your projects? I think the biggest thing that stands out is the ability to adapt it to a lot of configurations. So from an engineering standpoint, we can look at existing tankage, existing systems, and do a retrofit that no matter what we have to start with, it works. Uh, the other thing is, it's a process that for the operators is very easy to understand, operate, and maintain. It's a good diffuser system. It has energy efficiency built in, but yet it doesn't have any clogging issues or inside the tank maintenance issues that would cause the operators to have to be taking the process offline and draining it. So we see a lot of pluses, not just that it really does digest and reduce solids, reduce solids volumes going off site, but it, but it brings benefits to other parts of the process, things such as energy efficiency, uh, cleaner filtrates coming back, less load on your main treatment process. Those are some of the things we see as we use the product. What level of expertise and support does Ovivo contribute to your projects? Um, Ovivo as a company, and, and I've been dealing with them for something like 15 years now, uh, we get great support from the concept phase through the detailed design right through the operation. Uh, they're very willing to help us as the engineer uh, fit this product into existing designs, uh, give us their experience, help us with some of the more difficult complex parts of figuring out the aerobic digestion equations, and then providing a product that is, that is a well-engineered, well-constructed product, and one that does the job. And when we have those little issues during startup, trying to get the process just right, they're there working with us side by side to, to get the product working the way it has to. And again, we've always had success with it. How do life cycle costs compare against other alternatives you've considered? In terms of life cycle costs, we don't usually end up doing a life cycle cost on just the digester portion of a project. Sometimes we're doing it as an upgrade and we can identify benefits uh, ahead of time, but not in terms of a life cycle. Usually we're trying to address operators' needs and concerns uh, and trying to achieve a goal. We've done larger projects where there's been many phases of an upgrade and we've included it and done life cycle costs on those projects. Um, but when you look at the benefits, um, the savings, I think if you were to do a life cycle cost, you'd get some very attractive numbers. Why would you recommend an Ovivo system to someone considering aerobic digestion? I would consider Ovivo recommending it to, to anyone because I've actually done about seven or eight projects with Ovivo's aerobic digestion product. I always have a successful project, I always have a satisfied client, and I have operators who are operating the process and getting not only the desired results, but sometimes better than expected results. When you have that kind of a success, why do you want to venture into uncharted waters? For more information, please contact your local Ovivo sales representative or visit us on our website.